here comes our next fabulous magician. I am Bruno Tarnecci, and I am in love. I entered circus school when I was 12. And riding a unicycle and juggling were just crushes. But magic, that was love. By 21, it was mutual. I won the grand prize for magic in Latin America. If my home of Peru is the rhythm and flow of my performance, being touch objects are my magical partners. Like a cane I saw in the window of an antique shop. I knew I had to have it in my life, but I didn't know why. Until one day, it called out to me. Hey, here I am. Let's do something. Tonight, that very same cane will be my accomplice. Ben, tell her, I hope you enjoy our magic duet. I saw an antique store, a vintage store. So I saw the cane over there and I fell in love. And then I started realizing that I can, I can create my own dancing cane routine. Is there a story in your performance that you could share with us? Well, I'm from Lima, I'm from the coast. So I'm always in, relationship with, uh, in relation with the water. So how it moves the cane and how the cane floats is like to be in, in the water, something like that. Okay, Bruno, I hope your magical cane is a mystery to the boys. Let's find out. Boys? Well, Bruno, you were sure raising cane up there. Um, <laughs> what a... <laughs> 
<laughs> what, a, what a great routine. Um, and, you know, Teller is a real expert at animation of stuff. Teller's done three major tricks over the years that do animation of objects. We're watching in very different ways. I was just watching a movie. It was one of the most magical things you can do is the animation of an inanimate object. And I was just watching it that way. But Teller was watching it uh, technically and telling me afterwards um, some of the amazing innovations you made as a lot of the stuff that you uh, you created for this, right? A lot of stuff is original to you. Yeah. And one of the things you're doing in this routine that's so brilliant is you're accomplishing this stuff in many different ways, which is one of the most important things to do in magic so that one method cancels out the other and cancels out the other. And I'll tell you, uh, we just love the routine. Tell her drew all sorts of stuff and kind of took me to school on this, but um, I, um, I uh, don't think you fooled Teller, but I think the audience will tell us that you sure fooled them and they loved it. <laughs> Didn't you? Did you guys love it? I mean, the was just spelled by the just, just wonderful, wonderful, wonderful act. So uh, they loved you, I loved you, Teller loved you, everybody loved you, but I don't think you fooled us. Thank you. Thank you. Do you believe Penn? Do you think they figured it out? Yes, yeah, sure. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, he's a master. <laughs> Give him another warm round of applause. Penn and Teller time. See the Las Vegas legends perform right after this.